Hey, get this shit. Hear that? Get this shit. See that? Man, got this shit on me because I'm juicy as fuck. Joshua Minoy, man, I'm back at Zoo Culture today. I'm in the red and white. Would have said it's my light skinned Dracula fit, but Phil has that on right now. He's in the red and black, as you can see. We got these from longgear.com, obviously. If you couldn't read, if you can't spell, Code Blaze is gonna be 10% off, save money, look better in the gym, lift better. Just be more raw. Raw dog, no condom. Joshua Minoy, he's my fucking Code Blaze. <laughs> All right, what do you have to say about that? I, you go raw? You, whatever, of course. You go raw? Of course. of course. Do whatever this man says. You wanna look like this? Paint over there, bro. Look at that. Look at that vein in his bicep, bro. Look at that. The runoff like vein. Woo! Hey, wait. Buy some raw gear. What's the use code? code uh, Blaze? Yeah, man. Blaze. Use yeah. code Blaze. Yeah. Yeah, I do. Yeah. You yeah. Be savage in the gym? Do it. Let's yeah. Do, it. do that. Listen to him. Listen to me. Use code Blaze. Use code Blaze. For this video, it's the best exercises for back development. We're gonna start it off as you saw was wide grip pull-ups. Wide grip, as wide as you can go. We're not doing this, we're not doing this, we're not doing this. We're trying to go as wide as possible. So we're gonna go as wide as possible because everybody knows a wide back gets a hose in the sack. The wider you go with the grip, the wider the squeeze, the wider you open your lats, you extend your scapula, you'll stretch the muscles out, ultimately aiming for that fuller development. So we're gonna do wide grip pull-ups, three sets, however many you can handle. Don't go to failure though. I did a set of 14 to 16. Got up to 16, I'm gonna do two more sets. Then we're gonna get this bitch started. After the pull-ups, we're going straight into the bent over rows. Usually, I'd set up somewhere over there where the squat racks are. I would have the pegs down here so I can mount the bar, put the plates on, be able to lift it off, back up, and get the set started. Today, since there's a school of people over there, that whole area is packed, I'm gonna take a, a bench. And I'm, I'm sure you're not supposed to do this, but I'm gonna take a bench, I'm gonna use it for bent over rows. So I'm gonna take the bar off the rack, and I set it on the freaking the bench so I can lift it up, back off in front of the, the bench, and hit my sets. We're gonna go up to as heavy as we can go. Sets of eight to 10. Eight to 10, intro to the warm up will be probably sets of 15. We'll probably do two sets of 15, start going heavier, sets of eight to 10. So I'm gonna try to go three plates. Actually, no, fuck that. I'm going to three plates because I ain't no bitch. And then we're gonna move on to the next exercise. So let's we'll get right into it. Don't know what time it is. Peep this, watch this. I got a little surprise for you. You know we got a match today. Got the red fit on. Say something, haters. Say something. Watch me pull a shit ton of weight that you can't pull with these gloves on. Hey, check this out. So I got the close grip handle set up. We're gonna be doing seated. Actually, it's a seated variation of lat pull downs. I'm gonna show you the motion right now. I'm gonna drop the weight a little bit. We're gonna sit ourselves under the bench under the bench we're gonna sit ourselves under the bench here as opposed to actually sitting on the seat so you're gonna get yourself into a locked in position on the bottom more than likely you'll be on your your tippy toes you'll be flexing your calves to try to get your thighs up here so that when you let the weight up and get the stretch you're not gonna be getting pulled up yourself and we'll start on the 140s we'll start there we'll get eased into it at the 140s then I will go up, man. I don't even know how heavy today. We'll see. 
I'm going over 200. That's all I know. You want to know why? I do. You want to know why? Phil. That's why I asked. And the rest of my viewers and subscribers, you want to know why I'm going at least 200? Because I ain't no bitch. Alright, so we got the fourth exercise coming up right now. We're doing landmines. So we have a straight bar set up on the floor. I got a handle variation that's gonna be like this as opposed to the V bar. We're gonna have it out, outward like this, like we're doing a bent over row in a sense. It's kind of like a bent over row simulation. So I'm gonna go ahead and give the demonstration right now. Rev this bitch up like that. Make sure it's in the right gear. I'm gonna set up right around here. Pull up. Don't be doing half reps, please. We're not doing this. Give the full stretch as low as it can go before hitting the ground. Obviously, the 45 pound plate will give you less of a range of motion. As opposed to a 25, you can go a little lower. But we're trying to go as heavy as possible right now. So I got the 45 on that bitch. You're not going to be upright with your back. We're not doing these. We're going to be somewhat lower. Not parallel to the deck. Probably good 25, 30 degrees higher. So now I'm going to put on a few more plates and we're going to get juicy. Number five, we got lat pull throughs. So I went ahead and set this up on the cable machine. The way we're gonna do it, the setup, have your body at a slight bend forward. Not necessarily like 45, a, like slightly before 45, so you can give your, your lats a good stretch when we come up to the top of the stretch. So bring it back down. You're not gonna fully extend your arms. This isn't a tricep movement, so when you come to the bottom, don't extend. You're gonna keep a slight bend in your arms the whole time. Going through your elbows to get the contraction in your lap. I'll demonstrate. So I got my hands as wide as they go. Some people do closer, some people do wider. I like doing wider. Anything when it comes to back, my philosophy is the wider grip you go, the wider your back's gonna be. So, take my word for it. Like I said, juice doesn't lie. So, we got this set up right now. Boom. Top of the stretch, don't lock them out. Keep that slight bend. Bring back in, don't fully extend your arm. Keep that slight bend. Up to the top, back down. Look at this dude. <laughs> so the final exercise I got right now, I'm on a seated row machine. I got the widest handle right here, as opposed to going all the way out here. That's probably a weird ass angle, <laughs> looking down at the crotch region, but I'm gonna pull my hands in a little bit to where it's still straight on the bar because I wanna be able to pull as far back as possible. 
this will restrict my range of motion because it's already at a bent position. It'll take away from the contraction. So I have my hands right here. I'm gonna set up. I'm be coming as far down as I can, pulling to my belly button. Hey, so if I could tell you guys one thing, it would be that sometimes in life, when you have to look at yourself in the mirror, when you when you thought about when you were younger, and then you thought about the time that you were with your mom in the car, right? When you were with your mom in the car and the conversations that you had when you were younger, did you ever think that when you were at the grocery store, getting pushed around in the cart, that sometimes in life, you would be where you are today? Think about that. And don't you forget it. Don't forget. Never forget. Never settle. That's motivation. That's right. That's some real motivation What's for you. What's up? He went Overtaking so in the depth. vlog, see? We're, we're overtaking it. Yeah, right now. yeah. This hell is yeah, content. Hell yeah. Huddle up. <laughs> yeah. Huddle up. Huddle up. Huddle up, Dom. Yeah. Huddle up, Dom. Yeah. What's good? What's going on? Yeah, what uh, I have? just finished the uh, the best exercises for back development video for my YouTube channel. Well, what'd you do? Because we're going back. Hey, check me out. So I started off with wide grip pull-ups. Wide grip pull-ups. Then I went over to <laughs> bent over rows. Fudda hoes. Oh, I had to choose because they were all over there. Fudda hoes. Fudda hoes. So I went over and I grabbed a... At what point did you do the simplify straight arm push downs? See, I'm a reservist. Oh. So outside of military duty, okay. I'm doing everything with the utmost raggedy form. Yeah. Nothing, so like, nothing's like going to Like a half simplified. Half simplified. Yeah. yeah. Simple partial. Partial. Yeah. Partial, yeah. Simple partial reps. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like Say that again? Constant. Hoorah. Ho okay. He got it right. I thought you said hoo-yah. No, hoo hoorah. Hoorah. Right? That's, that's Navy. Oh, I, I was about to get you. Yeah, no. I was about no. to. You already know. You already know. That's, yeah. Hey, man. We're out of here, dude. Yeah. Like go. the video, comment, subscribe if you like the content. They're about to hit back. Subscribe. subscribe. They can do their own thing though. Subscribe. Subscribe. Hit that little red button. Hey, you know Dom. What, what do they need to do? What button do they need to hit? I need to get um, huh? You need to think about yeah. when you were with your mom when you were younger, and then you need to hit the subscribe button. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> Let her motivate you to hit the subscribe button. If she raised you right, you will hit the subscribe button. How about that?